and welcome to um, um, another uh, episode of Sin City Wars main tutorial. Uh, mini tutorial. Um, this is actually just in Sim View, but um, re um, I not City View, but there's actually a way you can see the entire city. I I just been recording each individual tutorial. I'll show you in the region view, but there's other things around this, like. This is just part of a very solid thing. It's just to stop it from rendering a bunch of things at the same time because this is designed for uh, smaller computers. Welcome to the main menu tutorial. So, you know how to get a city started in the basics of how to play, right? If not, you should exit this tutorial, or in your case, um, exit this video and go back, uh, um, not go back to the region. And, um, and, uh, well, go back to my channel page and view the previous video on, um, getting, the beginning star tutorial, one of the previous videos. So, this tutorial will address the number one reason new mares fail. Bankruptcy. Remember, making money is one of the keys to success in SimCity. Continue to move forward. Bleeding money. Leave out close to 50,000 simoleons in the bank and the population of around 2,000. We've got ourselves a nice slow down, right? Wrong. If we don't do something, the city's going to be, to be bankrupt. And I mean fast. Just look at the budget. Um, seeing that, this music is really awesome. I love the music in this game. It's so good. This game has the best music. Like, the best music of any game I know. I, and I would, I, sometimes I listen to this music this normally, not even in the game, because this music is so awesome. Anyway, just look at the budget. Come on, just look at the budget. Why isn't your FPS going better? Sending more than we're making. Look at the budget. Uh, l look at the budget. Uh, look at the budget window. Um... <laughs> Looking at the budget window uh, shows we're currently sending in pink more than we're making in green. And that's not good. We're losing a bunch of simoleons every month. We need to minimize our expenses. If we don't, we'll eventually be booted out of office with our, uh, when our city funds run dry. Click, uh, click the continue button to move forward. I shouldn't have read that. I'm not supposed to read that. Query school. Our city has built an elementary school. What a nice mayor. But let's take a closer look at how much it's costing us every month. Reduce local school funding like all evil mayors do. Reduce the funding and busing so there are more in line with your needs. Move the local funding slider and left. Do the student capacity just a bit larger than the number of students. Well, I guess it's a good mayor, I mean. That's not that bad. It's just making it not so ridiculous. It's just not good when, um, you got spending so students don't get what they need. But this is okay. And that's until it's around twenty-five dollars. The best funding. I love this music so much. I hear this is an awesome song. You know, I'm actually gonna secretly cheat a little bit. I mean, that doesn't really make much difference. Ah, that's better. Now it fits everyone. No, well, it's not really around twenty-five dollars. Um. This is cutting off so many students, though. <sighs> Funny is so tough.
free clinic, so he saved a few hundreds of millions to the local elementary school. Remember, set local budgets to suit your needs. Let's do the same at local clinic. Reduce local clinic funding. I don't really mind that as much as the school. I just think people should be educated. We're at full funding at the clinic and we have a handful of patients. Let's cut our funding accordingly. If you're having a hard time finding the clinic, zoom in. But zoom out again so you'll be able to see the coverage ring. Move the local funding slider to the left until the patient capacity is just a bit larger than the number of patients. No, to move the f uh, f ambulance slider, let's shrink the coverage ring a little bit. Yeah, capacity to number of people there is actually quite okay. I often do that in my own cities. Oh. Do I have to use my trackpad for this? Oh. So close to Andrig. You just. Okay, I'm gonna move the local ambulance funding so um it's reasonable. Or some people just have to come home and then the ambulance will take them up. What that that doesn't work out. That I'm gonna just today around the residential area. I'm actually being this down a lot, so it's quite nice. So you probably have the school a lot bigger. Is, is the budget balanced yet? Let's take a look at the budget again. Are we making more through taxes? Green? Then we're spending pink? No, we're not there yet. Looks like we'll have to remove some expensive structures that we can't avoid right now. Costing, cost cutting is rough, isn't it? Yeah, not really, unless you're reducing school funding, in my opinion. Um. Whoa! <laughs> Don't move my computer off the desk or away from the charger. I don't want to unplug it. <laughs> um. Too much, too soon. A common problem that new mayors... Hmm, I can see the grid. <laughs> uh, a common problem that new mayors run into um, is giving their fledging towns too much. You should only give them what they need when they need it. For example, this town is swimming in water. It just doesn't really need yet. You probably actually keep it. Um, you should only give them what they need when they need it. I think they need it. I mean, who doesn't want running water? Um, I mean, I think there's other things that are taking the cost up. I mean, that only costs like $100 a month, I think. For example, this town is swimming in water, which doesn't really need yet. Later, when we have positive cash flow and we're uh, and ready for wealthier and higher density buildings, then we can add water. Just remove the California Plaza and Police Station and all that. I don't have enough money. Right now, we're spending 350 million a month, which we can even make up for by deleting some other structures. I don't like very much. On maintaining a large water pump. Isn't that a small water pump? That's not a large water pump. 
There is a large water pump in this version of the game. <laughs> it's a bit drastic, but let's bulldoze the money. The the the, the, the money sucker. Hey, look, the Centropolis van. The blue thing there. That's a mod I have. It even appears in the tutorials. You're not building anything. Those mods. We have tons, tons of mods. Including just random ones. Well done. That saves us some cash. There are a few more civic services that are draining our budget that we should deal with. Let's continue to move ahead. Oh, the Centropolis fan again. I like that band so much. There are a lot of them. Removing fire station. The fire coverage and police station in this town are top notch! But guess what? They're costing you a bunch of money each month! Uh, you don't really need them yet. Remember, place your first all fire station. You have your first fire, not before. And place your first all police station when crimes actually become a problem. Yeah, I can understand that. So let's uh, bulldoze the fire station. Now, uh, crime won't be a problem until this town grows a bit bigger. So, large valuation, we could probably afford a police station, but we're not there yet. Select the demolish tool and click the police station to demolish it. <gasps> yeah, I can finally beat the police! I'm not actually not happy about that, but it's not like I mind that much about bulldozing the police station either. I mean, I don't care for police that much. All that zooming. <laughs> oh, for nothing. The wall's landmark, even though we don't need to. I mean, look how much money we. Ooh, uh, pff, actually, pulling my screen for some reason. Look how much money we uh, we're spending. It doesn't really matter, does it? Over in your plaza, it's certainly a loving building, but guess what? It's costing us a whole one hundred dollars a month. <gasps> Landmarks beautify a city, even w and even help commercial desirability, but they don't make sense. We're losing so much epic money each month. Time to take it down. Time to take it down. See, we could have afforded the water. Positive cash flow. Hey, Mayor, fine. Take a look at the budget now. Our monthly income is finally more than we're spending. We did it. We balanced the budget and we're making some money. But let's take a look at one thing. Taxes. This is where the city gets almost all of its income. Click the budget panel to extend it. There are actually other ways, like city ordinances. There's a gambling one that gives more. Look what money we're making in the... RCI sectors, as I like to say it. They have actual probable ICI, right, right, not ICI, RCI in terms of the mods I have. Tax rate. This is the window where you can change all of the tax rates. The higher the tax rate, the higher the population, the more money your city earns. Be careful. If you raise taxes too much, it can scare folks off. Lowering taxes for a certain group can make your seem more attracted to that group. For example, when your city is better educated, you might want to discourage dirty industry by raising the tax rates for that group. I love to do that. Good work! You've completed this tutorial. Remember, these steps in your city and you'll be rolling in cash in no time. Make local funding match your needs. Don't build structures until you need them. And taxes are your main source of income. Try playing the city and building it up to 20,000 sims. Hint. Heart by zoning some more residential zones. Look at the tutorial. 
might continue to play this city or return the regional view to play another city. I actually might want to play this city, but... Now... Exit it. Exit and city. And you also try to build it... A 20,000 sim. Huh, what? Raised computer users eat bulky machine. Takes tiny bites. What? Make the water back. I like water. Might make this a longer um video. But that's okay. Cause I fixed that uh problem. They have large water pump. See, that's actually a large water pump. This is not. Does anyone ever have a smoke detector? I think there's an audience for that. Like, right now. And legalize gambling. That makes some more money. And I'm going to put a smoke detector program. So I'm gonna see what that means. Oh wow, that only has two simoleons. Open source for casino operating setup business. Deals can be uh, cut up with casino operating or income. These come at the cost of a local mayor rating and potential crime elements. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smoke detector program. And this is more insulation detectors in every building. Just increase the effect of the fire department. How much does that cost? Hmm. That sounds nice. Ooh, what's that? An arrow. Clean air act. <gasps> oh, that's nice. I don't need the carpool incentive program. Clean air act. That's useful. Yeah, it's nice. Oh, Automobile Mission Reduction Act. Oh, I need that. Didn't see all these before. Smog Mission Terminals.
Yeah, I love electric cars. Say in 2004, so you don't have much with electric cars. There's like a Nissan Leaf charging station in D5, but this in D4, yeah, pro reading campaign. What's that? It may not carpal incentive for him. But commuter shuttle. Sir. No carpool. No, 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 actually, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. So, more residential. Lag spike. <laughs> I think the city could use a main avenue too. We'll just cover it in the rush hour tutorial. Simulation connection. It's a good idea. Ah, oh, 
finally. Oh, what? Guess that water wasn't in there. What kind of commentary is this? I forgot I was making a video, sorry. Now works. I wonder why no sims are moving in. What am I making? Commercial zone? I think I've had this problem before.
No sense sealed for some odd reason. Oh, finally, they're building. I guess now it works as commercial zones. Finally. It's so weird the way they do that. If anyone has any tips for com uh, com uh, commentating, that would be nice, because I really bad at it. I'm like the worst YouTuber in the world when it comes to that. No, I forgot about the roads. <laughs> I think we could afford that extra three hundred dollars. This game is so slow. And this video is probably so long now. I just bulldoze this and this. Maybe this. Will it now work? I guess so. That was kind of weird. Oh well, this has been a long video, so I'll see you next video when I finish this. Bye!